G'day mates, and welcome to the first of many creepy countdowns. Gang membership and initiations run deep through human history. Many of these gangs were created on the back of terrible persecution and rebellions, and as such, there has always been an element of gaining trust within gang membership to ensure that the initiating members are not in some fashion undercover for rival groups. However, some of these gang initiation processes can be pretty confronting and downright horrible. And today, we will be taking a look at 5 gangs and will be counting down the top 5 creepiest gang initiations. Number 5. The Hells Angels The Hells Angels are a notorious motorcycle gang and are known for their love for the Harley Davidson motorcycle and for being one of the big four motorcycle gangs alongside the Pagans, the Outlaws and the Banditos. The Hells Angels trace their origins back to the First World War, in which American war immigrants initiated the gang within the United States. The famous skull and wings insignia that is worn on the jackets of its members has been attributed to a previous president of the gang within the San Francisco district, while the colours and shape of the logo were inspired by a fighter and bomb squadron during the war. The process to become a member of the gang is lengthy and involves remaining a hangaround for years. However, once the hangaround is done fulfilling his part of the initiation, he then begins the final part of the initiation process. This part of the initiation process is called gaining the full patch. The term full patch is stated as a credit to those who are able to receive and wear the renowned four piece crest or logo. Prior to this, the initiating member may only wear two of the crest pieces. However, the final stage of the Hells Angel initiation process is far more cumbersome. In order for the hangaround to be fully initiated, he must wear a pair of brand new jeans and a jacket with an emblem of a skull. These clothes are then covered with a bucket of communal feces while the potential member is still wearing them. These clothes are then never to be washed and are to be defended to the death. Number 4. The 27s. The 27s, or the Notorious Numbers Gang, are a gang that operate primarily within South Africa and are one of the most notorious gangs on the planet. The 27s get their name through a series of associates with differing numbers within different prisons which make up the umbrella term, the Numbers Gang. The origins of the gang remain shrouded in speculation and mystery, however, the gang spread quickly upon consummation and is now located within the walls of most, if not, every prison within South Africa. Initiating members into the 27s requires the new member to stab a white prison warden with a personally made knife. Obviously, this is likely to result in the death of not only the warden, but also the inmate who is attempting to join the gang. Number 3. MS-13 MS-13 are an international criminal gang that have their origins within California. The gang is predominantly made up of Salvadorans and is a cross-continent entity. Members of the gang define themselves by wearing tattoos that cover their body and face. The gang is also known for developing and using a unique form of sign language to communicate. The group is involved in many illegal activities, none less than human trafficking, murder, arms trafficking, drug trafficking, and kidnapping to name only a few. The gang is said to have originated after the Central American Civil War of the 1970s. The gang began as a source of protection for Central Americans from other Mexican and African American gangs that immigrants faced upon arrival to the United States. The gang is said to have 50,000 members globally and approximately 10,000 of those members reside within the United States. The gang has also been known to be involved in child prostitution and members have been sent into prison for life sentences after recruiting runaway juvenile females for prostitution. Initiates are required, as a sign of their commitment to the gang, to select a random person and to shoot them with a pistol provided by the gang. The initiation has been linked to numerous deaths of women within the United States. Number 2. The Bloods The Bloods are primarily an African American gang. This gang began in Los Angeles, California and is widely known for its rivalry with the Crips, another notorious gang within America. The gang has been known to require members to know and express certain gang symbols through particular hand gestures and to wear the color red. 
The Bloods were founded as a result of the Crips' domination of particular locations within the states. Initially, the name Bloods was used as a universal term between various gangs to demonstrate a camaraderie between various smaller gangs in their attempt to fight back against the Crips. This alliance soon resulted in the establishment of the Bloods. The Bloods have been known to set members within US military and overseas bases on various occasions. The gang is estimated to have between 7,000 and 15,000 known members. Initiation into the Bloods requires two new recruits to slash a stranger's face with razors. This recruitment process has been known to result in 135 mutilations in New York in one month alone. Number 1. The Triads the Triads are one of the many branches of Chinese organized crime. The gang is based amongst many Asian countries, but is much more dense within significant Chinese populations. This particular gang is very much a global entity and has its hands involved in many rings of organized crime, both white and blue collar. It is speculated that the gang originated back in the time when the British colonized Hong Kong. It has been also speculated by many that the gang is a branch of the original revolutionary movement stemming back to the White Lotus Society, Taiping Rebellion, Boxer Rebellion, and the Heaven and Earth Society. The Triads are known for counterfeiting currencies, trafficking drugs, and fraud throughout the world. Initiation into the gang requires a member to drink a bowl of communal blood. However, after some initiated members contracted AIDS, the gang made exceptions for members being initiated within areas known to be prone for contracting the disease. As a result, the initiating members must drain enough blood from themselves to fill a bowl, and then drink their own blood. G'day mates, it's Bee Buster here. Well, I hope you enjoyed this creepy countdown. If you would like to watch more creepy videos, be sure to subscribe and to check out my other channel where I narrate scary stories. Also, be sure to catch me on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram for updates throughout the week. I hope you enjoyed this video, thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you mates in the next one.